Welcome to the support video for workload automation video series. This video will demonstrate how can I delay the next rerun of Ctrl M cyclic jobs when it fails. For example, when job fails, we can delay the execution according to the defined wait time prior to the next rerun. This is by setting the pre-execution or pre-CMT command before running the actual job command or script. We need to use the command sleep for unix or underscore sleep.exe for Windows machine using the arguments in second. Also, please note, using this method will adjust the job statistics calculation because of the added delay time when the job started. It's login from WLA GUI, and from this demo, I define one cyclic job from planning domain with interval of 5 minutes and set the delay to 120 seconds if the job fails. Under the general tab, Set the pre-execution command for the job to sleep based on a variable percent percent wait time using the arguments in seconds. Then set the local variable wait time to zero to assure that the job is not delayed on its first run. And under the action tab, set the undo actions to change the value of the local variables based on the job status. This set the time to sleep for the next rerun. When the job ends, not okay, set the variable to 120 seconds. When the job ends, okay, set the variable back to zero. To save it, let's check in the created job. Then proceed to order the job and execute it. Let's go to monitoring domain. And now release the job. From the first cycle, the job fails. Click the log to check the wait time variable and it shows it is set to 120 seconds. It means on the next cycle based on the next time interval of 5 minutes, the job will run the pre-execution command sleep 120 seconds to delay the actual execution of the command or script. After waiting the next interval, the job executed and runs the pre-execution command of sleep 120 seconds before the execution of the actual script. From the logs, It added additional runtime of 120 seconds delay as shown here. And since it completed successfully, the wait time variable is set to zero, means the job will not perform the pre execution command and execute immediately without any delay. Again, waiting for the next interval after the successful run. The job executed without any delay. That concludes this Ctrl M solution video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this.